thank you Holy Ghost as we are lifting our hands something great is about to happen today you are not here by chance you are not here by coincidence you are here by divine appointment and divine orchestration those that are joining us from around the world something good is about to happen i hear the lord say to somebody you are days of crying you are days of tears they are coming to an end your story will change your star will shine every blessing that god has ordained for you this month i declare it will not pass you by something good is about to happen i declare everywhere you go this month you shall receive favor i speak as an oracle every door you shall knock this month i declare that door shall be open i terminate negative reports i terminate negative reports in the name of jesus i declare good things are about to happen i reject every every backward journey in the name of jesus i paralyze every strong man assigned to distract your elevation i speak as an oracle to those that are here to those that are connecting live i declare you will walk in victory you will walk in grace you will walk in divine elevation something great is about to happen something great is about to happen every satanic altar i declare it will be destroyed in this service i said it will be destroyed in this service every enchantment against your life every divination against your destiny every charm that is working against you i declare holy ghost fire holy ghost fire every demonic altar that is raised against you that is working against you we declare catch fire every demonic sacrifice that has been raised against us and our families every demonic sacrifice that has been raised against our businesses i declare holy ghost holy ghost holy ghost every demonic arrow that is targeted against our lives and families i declare back to the center back to the center back to the center somebody say after me every demonic arrow targeted against my life against my family back to the center i stretch my hands to those that are here to those that are watching us live i decree and declare any man or woman that has joined hands to fight you god will fight them may god contend with what is contending against you may god fight what is fighting you in this service i declare war against curses against evil ordinances i reverse the works of wickedness anyone that has paid a witch doctor for your downfall i declare it will backfire any man or woman that has carried money to a witch doctor to fight you i declare holy ghost fire holy ghost fire holy ghost fire any man or woman that has taken money to a shrine to fight your destiny i decree and declare back to the center back to the center i speak over your life you shall not be afraid of the terror by night know the arrow that flies by day i declare the battles are won in your favor oh lord deploy angels deploy angels deploy angels deploy angels i declare from today somebody say i am born to win i am more than a conqueror victory 
is mine. I cannot be stopped. I cannot be denied. I cannot be delayed. Oh God, arise. 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 I speak as an oracle. No evil shall come near your dwelling place. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Father, I decrease that you may increase. I disappear that you may appear. Give me the unction to function. In Jesus' name, shout amen. amen. Hallelujah. Greet two people. Tell them you are blessed because you came. And you may have your seat in the presence of God. Please, I want you to greet three people. Tell them you are blessed because you came. To those that are joining us live from around the world, connect to collect. I tell people, you cannot be connected to grace and be disgraced. Hallelujah. So may heaven honor you. Can we appreciate the online church, sons and daughters, global partners, everybody that is watching, those that are watching for the very first time, connect to collect in Jesus' name. Second Kings chapter 2 and verse 19. And the men of the city said to Elisha, Please notice the situation of the city is pleasant. As my Lord sees, but the water is bad and the ground is barren. And he said, Bring me a new bowl and put salt in it. So they brought it to him. Then he went out to the source of the water and cast in the salt there and said, Thus saith the Lord, I have healed this water. I have healed this water. From it there shall be no more death or barrenness. So the water remains healed to this day, according to the word of Elisha which he spoke. I want you to lift your hand as you're seated wherever you are and just begin to speak in the Holy Ghost. Heavenly Father, we are gathered in your presence to hear your voice let your word come forth with power and with clarity let your people be blessed let your people be empowered let me be your mouthpiece let your word in my mouth be like fire lord we leave our burdens at the feet of jesus christ father speak to your people in the language they will understand father your word says the word is like a hammer the word is like a fire the word is like a sword the word is a weapon use your word to crush the forces of darkness and evil Le paragadoska. father use me as an instrument to bless your people give me the anointing that makes preaching and teaching easy let me speak only of your counsel in the name of jesus let the prophetic mantle rest upon every person that is here and that is connecting live i bring myself under the submission and under the subjection of the holy ghost those that are watching live on facebook on youtube in their homes on oracle one tv in their offices wherever they are in the nations of the world let the same unction let the same anointing on ecc affect and touch them wherever they are let paragados let your people be blessed lord quicken my heart and my, and my mind bring to remembrance the things you have taught me father help me to convey your word clearly help us to grow in the grace and in the knowledge of our savior jesus christ let miracles begin to abound we pray for direction we pray for healing in this service we pray for deliverance in this service we pray for open doors in the name of the father the son and of the holy spirit shout amen look at your neighbor tell them the curse is reversed come on turn to two people tell them the curse is reversed the Lord laid it in my heart even as we come to the grand finale of this message that God laid in my heart of reversing evil, reversing curses and evil decrees and ordinances. This is a word that God laid in my heart strongly and I believe with all of my heart by the end of the service, every evil word that was spoken against your life, against your destiny, against your advancement, it will be reversed. 
reversed uh, any curse that was made against your life your family it will be reversed in the name of Jesus now watch this the Bible says uh, I'm laying a foundation and I'm coming the men of the city came to the prophet Elisha one thing I want to thank God for is for his prophets uh, because by a prophet Israel was delivered and by a prophet Israel was preserved every time God sends a prophet to his people he sends a prophet to profit you I don't know who I came for but God has sent me to profit you a prophet comes to profit you I've come to discover every time God sends a prophet God sends a prophet to announce what God is about to do second Chronicles 2020 believe in the Lord your God and you shall be established and believe in his prophets and so you shall prosper I've said it is CC and I'll say it again believing is in two ways you must believe in the Lord your God so that you can be established and you must believe in his prophets so that you can prosper and watch this now the people of the city they come to the prophet Elisha I believe they believed in the ministry and in the anointing and in the grace of God that was upon the prophet Elisha they say to Elisha the city is pleasant but the waters are barren my God the city looks good on the outside but the waters are barren I see in the realm of the spirit there are people that are seated here under the sound of my voice and others are watching it is true you look pleasant and please look at your neighbor and tell them you're looking good ah you're looking good you're looking good but in the realm of the spirit I see here I am seeing beyond how you look because they say to the prophet Elisha the city is pleasant but behold the waters are barren you know the city looked good on the outside but it was dead and barren on the inside some of you you are looking good on that suit you are looking good in that dress you are looking good come on look at your neighbor and you know at ECC we slay and pray tell your neighbor it's true you are looking good but I know you are dealing with something uh, I know you are dealing with something and today I came to deal with that issue uh, I came to deal with that issue can I deal with it I said can I deal deal with that barrenness can I deal with that barrenness you know to be barren means to be unfruitful to be unproductive to be dry to be desert like I speak as an oracle any area of barrenness in your life any area of financial barrenness career barrenness barrenness in your business in your calling yeah. any area in your life that is not producing oh I command it to be fruitful yeah, every yoke of barrenness yeah. I command it to be destroyed yeah, in the name of Jesus yeah. somebody say my father my maker, my father, my maker. every area of barrenness in my life catch yeah. fire yeah. somebody open your mouth and declare I will be fruitful I will be fruitful I speak as an oracle from this service every curse that has affected your life it is reversed you will be fruitful in your life in your business in your profession in your destiny in your ministry in your calling I break the yokes of barrenness I break the yokes of barrenness. Yeah. I break the yokes of barrenness. Yeah. In the name of Jesus. Yeah. Look at your neighbor, sit down. Tell them be fruitful. Be fruitful. Hey. Come on, look at your neighbor. Tell them neighbor. neighbor. Be fruitful. Be fruitful. Shandele graska magadeshka. The city looked pleasant. But there was death in the city. Mm, the devil is a liar it is true from the outside everything looks like it is good but you've been dying on the inside crying yourself to sleep some of you have been peaceless but I stand as an oracle yes. 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 
anything that has been stealing your joy privately, oh, yes. I silence it in the name of Jesus. Anything that has been stealing your joy, I stand in my office as God's oracle. I silence it by fire. The Bible says weeping may endure for a night, but joy comes in the morning. I declare receive joy receive peace in your heart receive peace in your mind receive peace in your spirit in the name of Jesus somebody say my father my maker whatever has been stealing my joy be silenced in the name of Jesus sit down ask your neighbor how is your insight Hey, please talk to two people. Ask them, how is your inside? And it's okay not to be okay because we are in the solution center. Tell your neighbor, it's okay not to be okay. Ask your neighbor, how is your inside? Because watch this, verse 19. The man of the city said to Elisha, please notice the situation of this city. It is pleasant as my Lord sees, but the waters are part and the ground is paradox hey, the town was in a good location the climate was perfect the city was well built and beautiful to look at but there was a problem in the city today the Lord is dealing with that issue in your life that issue that has stolen your peace that issue that has taken your joy I hear the Lord say Le paragadoska, I am seeing divine intervention somebody say I receive divine intervention the ground was barren the people of Jericho walked and walked but that land was to no avail. Some of you have been working and working and working to no avail. You have nothing to show. You have tried every business. You have been employed for a long time, but you have nothing to show. The waters are bad and the ground is barren. I hear the Lord say your days of working and not producing are over. Amen. I declare in the name of Jesus, you will not labor in vain. Amen. I speak as an oracle. Yes. You will not labor in vain. Amen. I said you will not labor in vain. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Somebody say I refuse to labor in vain. I refuse to labor in vain. If the mighty name of Jesus. Sit down. The people of this city recognized that their hope was coming from God. They came to Elisha. Just as you've come to ECC today and to Miracle Monday. Because they had seen the power of God in his life. They recognized that God had anointed him. And what he spoke was from God. If you believe the prophetic word I am giving you today. I decree and declare your story will change. Amen. Wave your hand and declare my story will change. My story will change. Now watch this. And Elisha said to them. Bring me a new bowl. And he put salt in it. So they brought it to him. Bring me, a, bring me a new bowl. And put salt in it. So they brought it to him. The bowl he specified. Bring me a new bowl. Because it was representing God was about to do. Ah, it's on screen. And he said bring me a new bowl. And put salt on it. We are in the month of August. And we said eight is the number of new beginnings. He said bring me a brand new bowl. Symbolizing the new thing that God was about to do in the city. I hear the Lord say in this month of August. I know we've gone through uncertain times. We have gone through the valleys. We have gone through the mountains. We have gone through challenging times. The whole world has gone through the valley of the shadow of death. But I hear the the Lord say God is about to do a new thing Amen. I am seeing the Lord opening a new chapter in somebody's life I want you to lift up your hand and say Lord do a new thing in my life Lord. do a new thing in my life oh so the ball was symbolizing the new thing that God was about to do 
and the salt uh, the salt covenant is for dominion and I believe one of these days I'm going to teach on the salt covenant you know that anywhere you will go this year you will rule and reign in the name of Jesus salt preserves so he said bring me a new bowl and some salt ah le paragadoska can we have verse 21 can we have verse 21 verse 21 then he went out to the source of the waters mm. i see god dealing with your problem from the source Amen. hey can i speak to somebody speak god to is about to deal with your problem from the source hey. to ensure that affliction will not rise a second time hey. your problem will not be dealt with from the surface yes. I said from the source. Yes, yes. Somebody say, my father, my maker. My father, my maker. Deal with my problem from the source. Deal with my problem from the source. Lift up your hands, say, my father, my maker. My father, my maker. Deal with my situation from the source. Deal with my situation from the source. Deal with my family problems from the source. Deal with my family problems from the source. In the name of Jesus Amen. in the name of Jesus Amen. sit down I'm closing so he went to the source hey leparagadoska magadeshka can we have verse 21 mm -hmm. uh-huh then he went out to the source of the water and cast in the salt there and said thus saith the Lord I have healed this water from it there shall be no more death or barrenness mm. i hear the lord say healing is coming into somebody's life yes, yes, yes. there shall be no more death or barrenness in your life yes. you will not bury anyone young in your family yes. between now and 31st december yes. i stand as an oracle yes. you will not go to an early grave yes. you will not your family I come against the spirit of death I cancel our names and the names of our family from every death register in the name of Jesus any coffin prepared by the agents of death for our lives or for our family members we command it catch fire catch fire the covenant of long life over your family over your loved ones in the name of Jesus we declare no death somebody say I declare I will not go to an early grave I will not bury my children I will not bury my family members we cancel the spirit of death in the remaining months of this year I declare no death no barrenness I declare we shall walk in the covenant of long life the covenant of fruitfulness every business you shall begin it will be fruitful hey, your businesses will be fruitful your career will be fruitful your academics will be fruitful your relationships will be fruitful your ministry will be fruitful your finances will be fruitful your ideas will be fruitful your projects will be fruitful i stand as an oracle i stand in my office i declare no more barrenness no more death somebody say no more barrenness no more death in the name of jesus in the remaining months of this year i speak as an oracle go and prosper go and succeed go and excel receive 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 shandala paragadoska i want you for 30 seconds lift up your hands begin to speak over the life of your family members Le paragadoska Le paragadoska Shanda la paragadoska 
Le paragados. Can I have verse 22? As we are standing, God confirmed the word of Elisha because he confirms the counsel of his messengers. I speak to you as a messenger with a message. I may not have come to miracle Monday with wings like an angel, but I came as a messenger with a message. Watch verse 22 on screen. So the waters remains healed to this day according to the word of Elisha which he spoke by my spoken word does God's oracle yes, by my spoken word does God's mouth yes, I declare there shall be no death in your family yes, no barrenness yes, may God confirm this word with miracle signs and wonders yes, receive life I receive. receive life I, receive. I speak life to your family life to your relatives I, I speak life I want you for 30 seconds. I want you to pray for your family. Begin to declare life. Begin to declare no more barrenness over your children. I see members of your family coming out of stagnation. Those that are watching us live from around the world. I decree and declare no more barrenness. I cancel the spirit of premature death. I want you to mention the names of your family members. Open your mouth and begin to mention their names. Le Paragadoska. Begin to mention their names. Begin to mention their names. The Lord is about to intervene in your case. Begin to declare. Lord intervene in my case. Lord intervene in my case. Lord intervene in my case. As God intervened for the people of that city. May God intervene for your family. I declare you will not die young. You will not bury anybody in the remaining months of this year. Angels of death will not visit us and our family. Long life is our heritage. Long life is our heritage. Any demonic power that wants to cut short our life, we declare catch fire. Tragedy will be far away from us Amen. and our family members. In the name of Jesus, Amen. you will celebrate your 90th birthday. You will celebrate your 95th birthday. Le Paragadosta. I exempt your life. I exempt the life of your family members from the spirit of death, from the spirit of barrenness. Le Paragadosta. Every power of the grave that is speaking death in our families, we silence it by the blood of Jesus. Somebody say, I shall live and not die. Touch your neighbor, tell them, stay alive. Come on, touch two people, tell them, stay alive. Stay alive. Listen now as we are standing up. I want us to do something prophetic for our families. We are going to give a prophetic seed. We are going to hold it in our hands of declaring no more life and barrenness. Psalms 50 verse 5 says, Gather my people together, those that have made a covenant with me by sacrifice. I want you to give a family offering of declaring no more death and barrenness in the name of Jesus. So if you are here at ECC, you have that seed tangibly. I want you to speak over that seed. In this first miracle Monday in the month of August, it is a prophetic day. We have five remaining months before the end of the year. If you have that seed on your phone, you can give through our pay bill number that is on screen. Or you can give on M-Pesa. I want you to give what you've never given. To say, Lord, no more death, no more barrenness in my family. I want you to begin to speak about that seed. If you're giving that seed with your bank card, our kingdom hostess are on the right and on the left. You are going to give that seed in the name of Jesus. To those that are watching us live from around the world distance is not a barrier the spirit of God is speaking to you now I want you to give something you have never given before as a seed and as a sacrifice for you and your family you are watching me in America in London in Germany in Italy in Indonesia in Dubai in Qatar in Oman in Bahrain in Kuwait 
you're watching me in South Africa, in Rwanda, in Uganda, wherever you are, distance is not a barrier. In Switzerland, the Lord is speaking to you now. I want you to give. You can give on PayPal. Ah, as you as you comment how you want to sow, the media team is going to put up. Oracle One TV media team will put the link below your comment. I want you to connect. All that seed in the name of Jesus. Le paragadoska magadeshka. Eh, shandele bragados. Ze pragados. Shanda la graska magadeshka. I want you to mention the names of your family members. Speak over that seed. Come, I Simo. Hold that phone and declare. If it is on your card, if you have it tangibly, hold it and declare. There shall be no death in my family. I cancel barrenness. I will be fruitful. Your days of working and not producing are over. You will eat the good of the land. You will not suffer shame and reproach. The Lord will disappoint the expectations of our enemies. The Lord will silence the voice of the accuser. In the remaining months of this year, you will end this year with a testimony. You will end this year with celebration. Oracle One TV media team. Number for giving and partnership is 0710 84 21 21. Alternatively, you can give via pay bill. The business number is 222118. The account number is Empower Hash. You can also comment on this live broadcast, comment Wave, comment PayPal, comment World Remit, and you will be directed towards your giving. To all our Francophone countries, vous pouvez envoyer votre contribution par M-Pesa au numéro 0710842121. Vous pouvez également utiliser le numéro Paybill 222118 sur le numéro de compte Empower Hash. Merci beaucoup pour votre contribution. Que Dieu vous bénisse. Que Dieu vous fasse prospérer. En nom de Jésus. Amen. To those that are giving us so live, as you are connecting with this prophetic word, as you are sowing your seed on PayPal, on wave, on world remit, I declare no more barrenness. I declare no more death. May the covenant of long life be our heritage. Shandele bragados. Zeparagadesh. Father, every seed that is being sown on the altar of this ministry, fire of the Holy Ghost. Every seed that has been sown by those that are here and those that are watching us live. Let it be a voice that will speak on your behalf. I declare no barrenness in the name of Jesus. No barrenness. No barrenness. Somebody declare three times the curse is reversed. The curse is reversed. The curse is reversed. Just stand there. I declare over your life. Fire! Fire! Generational curses, ancestral curses, fire of the Holy Ghost, pick her up again. And I declare to everybody in this service and those that are watching us, you will be the deliverer of your family. You will be the redeemer of your family. You know, in every family, there is a Joseph. Fire! I set you free from generational curses, ancestral altars. Bring her the last time. Three is the number of totality. I declare in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, in the name of the Holy Ghost, be free. Fire of the Holy Ghost. You are free in Jesus' name. In every family, there is an Esther. In every family, there is a Joseph. In every family, there is a David. There is that person that God has ordained as the deliverer, as the redeemer of the family. I declare in that family, you are the deliverer. You are the redeemer. You are the way maker. Your family will be changed because of you. You are the barrier breaker. You are the line crosser. You are the territory taker. Receive in the name of Jesus. Somebody lift up your hands. I want to bless your family. Shanda Lagras. But there is one person I want to pray for. I am seeing you and your husband and you are praying. And it's like there has been a lot of barrenness in your life. 
I'm hearing the name of your husband is like Philip, but your name is Jackie. I need to pray for you. Your husband's name is uh, Philip, but your name is Jackie. I'm seeing it is like the situation uh, that I just ministered on. You know, things may be looking pleasant on the outside but i see there is barrenness the lord says no more barrenness lift up your hands if you are the one come quickly i need to pray for you before i i continue very fast lift up your hands your name the name of your husband is philip but your name is jackie i need Prophesy to pray for you. Oracle of God. what is your name your name is jacqueline what is the name of your husband stretch your hands towards her chandre bragadoska the Lord is telling me there shall be no barrenness because I'm seeing a church. I'm seeing like a church and it is like it, nothing is moving, nothing is working. It is like there is a spirit of stagnation. I'm seeing the numbers between 40 and 50. Nothing is moving. Every time you try to break the limit, you know, there is so much barriers, hindrances. And you know, ministry has become hard. And let me tell you, ministry is not a playground. It's a battlefield. Ministry is not fanfare. It is warfare. But I want to assure you, in spite of what you have been going through with your husband, I hear the Lord say, you are, you are, you are, you are, you are, battles that you've been facing they reveal your mantle look at somebody tell them your battles reveal your mantle your, your battles reveal your mantle, mantle. The spirit of God is transporting me in the realm of the spirit. And it is like I am in Busia. I am in Busia. What is your connection to Busia? Ndiyo nyumbani. Ndiyo nyumbani. Umetokea Busia. Ndiyo. Shanda la fragados. Ebu mnyoshe mikono. Na madhabau zote za kijijini zinazo kufuata mjini. Ninaziamrisha katika jina la Yesu. Ebu nyosha mikono kwenye madhabau. Madhabau za kijijini zinazo kufuata mjini. Ah, nazisambaratisha katika jina la Yesu. I want you to pray any altar from my village. Any altar from my That is contending with my life and my destiny. Any altar from my village. That is fighting my prosperity. Catch fire. Catch fire. Because I'm like in a village like Funyula. Funyula. What is this? I'm like in a village. Funyula ni nini? Division. Division munayo ishi. Leparanga. Can I go deeper? Can I prophesy? Today your story is changing. You will know you have stepped in the arena of miracles. Stretch your hands because of time. Shandala Bragados. You have been in a wilderness. You and your husband, Mumekua Jangwani. Lakini mungu ananiambia ni kwambia muna toka jangwani. You are coming out of the wilderness. Somebody say I'm coming out of the wilderness. I'm coming out of the wilderness. Stretch your hands towards her. Where is your husband? Ako nyumbani. Yosha mikono. Shande le bragados. As God is remembering you. He's remembering. I'm seeing this ministry. I'm seeing this ministry. God is remembering growth and expansion and enlargement is coming. Amen. I cancel every negative decree yes. against you and your husband and this ministry. Yes. What God ordains, he sustains. And what God has announced, no man can denounce. The Lord is telling me to tell you, hold on. The will of God will never take you where the grace will not protect you. But I know there are moments we go through situations we can't trust him. But the Lord says, even when you cannot trust him, trust him. I want you and your husband to trust the process. Sasa sikiliza. Mungu anaenda kukumbuka na kubadriki ata watoto wako. Naona uza watumbo lako. Shandre Bragadoska. I'm counting one, two, three, four. Shandre Bragadoska. How many children do you have? Una watoto waine. Pigia yesu makofu. Can I have the oil? You are the oil. Stretch your hands towards me. God is going to remember you. I'm also seeing a lot of financial stress. That financial stress is over. I'm seeing like a child and I'm seeing the child in like class 7. And I'm seeing you wondering how this child will go through high school. Because I'm seeing like class 7. I'm seeing like class 7. And uh, I'm seeing like class 7. I'm hearing like Cynthia. Who is Cynthia? This is my first girl. Akodarasa langatu. Can I go deeper? Go deeper, my prophet. Mungu mm. anasema atasomesha pia watoto wako. 
Jesus. As God is remembering you, He's not just remembering you only. He's remembering you and your family. Mama, any altar that has been contending with you from the day you were born, I break it in the name of Jesus. I break it. And for you, when I'm trying to locate the day you were born, I am seeing also a Monday. Ushai ambiwa siku yenye ulizaliwa ama haujui. Haujui, nitakwambia. Nabii amwambia asimwambie. Mwambie. It was Monday, 16th. I'm seeing like January. I'm seeing like 1989. Unajua birthday yako inakuanga lini? Birthday yako inakuanga tarehe 16 January. Mwaka wa mwaka wa mwaka mwaka gani? 89. Hey! My oracle, my mother is a prophet. Professor. Yes. I want you to go and ask. Hey. She said she doesn't know the day. Go and confirm. Are your parents there? Go and confirm. Stretch your hands because of time. Shandre Bragados. My God. Ziparagateska. Oh, yes. The grace I carry. Hey. I release it upon your life. Hey. Let this oil begin to speak for you. Oh, yes. Begin to speak for your husband. Yes. Begin to speak for your ministry. Amen. Begin to speak for your children. Yes. Collins will be a man of God. Collins will serve God. Collins. I see the priestly anointing on Collins. Who is Collins? My second born. You are second born. Accurate prophecy. Stand in the name prophecy. Of Fire. Fire. Oracle of God. The you are born to do this. Mm. Lift up your hands because of My time. My mother. I decree and declare oh, yes. to everyone here and everyone watching oh, yes. the curse is reversed. Amen. The decrees and the ordinances are reversed. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Sit down.